Kurt Scooby says, I like my plate to be big. I like to eat. Send me my Scooby snacks. And his promoter, Lou DiBella, describes him as a walking, talking action figure. We'll see if Narciso Carmona could dim some of that hype here in our main event. Round one underway, our main event, Kurt Scooby, Narciso Carmona. Eight rounds in the 140 pound division. Of course we saw Scooby just blast through Hammer and Hank Lundy last time out. It was that breakout performance against John Manu earlier in the year as well. Also a southpaw. Also a southpaw. Undefeated southpaw. But you know, that being said about Carmona, you know, he does look like he knows what he wants to do in there, and, and he is enacting his game plan and having some, some successes. I said, like I said in the first round, it's really the difference is the firepower. When Scooby lands, even if it's on his arm or his elbow, you know it, you hear it. Carmona trying to come forward a little bit here, just offering up that jab. Hard right hand connects there from Scooby as he goes back downstairs to the body. And the explosiveness just isn't in the thump of the power, Chris. It's in the footwork. It's, it's how quickly Scooby can kind of pivot into these shots and, and get back into position when he misses. Yeah, I mean, it, it, that's what athleticism is all about, his ability to change directions and be explosive um, and to have good balance. That's exactly what you find um, in high-level athletes in, in any sport. Trying to feint his way to the inside. Doesn't seem particularly bothered by what Carmona is offering up. Now you got a guy like Carmona a self-described stylist. You now he's going to be able to deal with the ebbs and flows and the ins and the outs, and we're seeing that with that slickness and slipperiness. See Carmona almost teasing Scooby with that opportunity along the ropes. I don't know for how long he wants to try this tactic, though. As Scooby breaks through, first with the left hand to the body, and then with that right hand with Carmona along the ropes. Yeah, to the good right hand to the nose. Good Carmona. Took upstairs from Scooby. Makes Carmona move halfway across the ring. You know, last round, Scooby took some of the power of his of his shots, restoring more volume, and had a lot of success. Got the nose of Carmona bloody, some blood from the mouth as well. His first couple rounds, he's really just loading up and hitting a lot of air. Yeah, I think it, we heard Elijah Pierce describe it as Scooby kind of figuring out where he can let his gun go off. And I think Scooby is figuring out that just a little bit more volume. A little less power, a little less loading up. A few more bullets and one might hit the target. I think, you know, punchers have to be careful not to fall in love with their power and just keep loading up and looking for the knockout. Make sure a one-dimensional fighter. And a guy, even like a guy like Carmona, who could be slick, make you miss enough. Go ahead and steal rounds. Hard right hand there. Connects from Scooby. His feet look, look down, shoot the shot up. Scooby. Scooby really just standing in front of Carmona, trying to intimidate him right here. You see him kind of peering over his gloves. Saying, is that, that all you have? Carmona doing a good job of avoiding the big shots, though. Yeah, Carmona not offering a lot other than that lead jab, but the movement and simply the offering of that jab has been enough to keep Scooby at bay as we take a look at Scooby's fiance sitting ringside. Doesn't look particularly worried about what's going on. And thus far in Scooby's career, hasn't really given her anything to worry about at all. He has been absolutely dominant. Tonight, not the same explosive performance we've seen in the last two outings for Kurt Scooby, but 
we're seeing a man in Scooby learn how to put those those connective tissues together as well. As we have a guy in Carmona who isn't just letting him walk forward and trap him along the ropes. Yeah, I mean, there's, gonna, there's so many different kinds of styles as way boxing such a nuanced business. I mean, you got to learn on the job, you know, especially a guy like Scooby who's coming from a, another sport. He doesn't have that vast amateur background like a lot of the, the top-notch guys that we see. So he's going to be learning on the job for the most most of his career. Scooby got out of the way of that right hook from Carmona a moment ago. Misses with his own uppercut. But mainly that pawing jab, jab and retreat. There's a nice lead left hand from Carmona. He found a home for that left hand on the middle. And gaining confidence as well. You see the hands at the side. Carmona having some of his best success of the fight. And starting to talk to Scooby on the inside. I told you, he was a confident man. I, saw, I, could, I could feel his confidence in the fighter meeting. Look at Carmona, two left hands in a row and a third back Scooby up. Best round of the fight so far, for sure, for Carmona here in round number five. Yeah, that last left hand from Carmona might not have landed. That one to the body did. Confidence growing. But the confidence again, yes, it, it is growing in Carmona visibly. Which can be dangerous. You can't walk into a shot now. And like I, I've been speaking so much about the firepower differential between the two. But, man, Carmona's having a great round. He digs to the body a moment ago with that left hand as well. Scooby trying to come back with an uppercut. But the first two minutes of this round certainly belonged to Narciso Carmona. The right hand there from Scooby catches. Carmona dipping down. What does your fighter need to do to solidify the win tonight? Just go to the body and keep using the jab. That's all. I mean, he's winning, but he's just, he's just not doing enough. I mean, he, he's winning. Oh. Don't fall asleep. Two good left hands upstairs. How are you feeling from about the Carmona. fight so far? Oh, I'm, we're winning. I'm fine with the fight. I'm fine with what he's doing. Just need to do a little more. Thank you so much. No problem. <laughs> Thank you so much, Rebecca. Very frank advice from the corner of a Kurt Scooby. Oh, big right hand there connects from Scooby. Oh, Carmona shook that one off, but he can't shake that one off. That's a hard right hand right down the middle. And that may be a turning point in this fight as Scooby is on the attack. Plenty of time left in the round. Big left hook upstairs. Scooby said, bring me my snacks, and he is looking to eat right now. Ref is looking real close. Third Scooby is devouring Narciso Carmona right now, and that is it. Kurt Scooby still undefeated. And no argument for Carmona when they stop that fight. Well, you see the danger of Kurt Scooby. Once he gets rolling, when he gets in rhythm, and when he lands, he has fight-changing power at 140 pounds. <laughs>